the nominee for a top U.S. national security role, saying a Chinese invasion of Taiwan is a real concern. Eli Ratner, U.S. President Joe Biden's pick to lead the Pentagon's Asia office, was speaking before the Senate at his confirmation hearing on Wednesday. He said the U.S. must invest more resources towards deterring Chinese aggression in the region. He also expressed support for President Tsai Ing-wen's defense policy and her efforts to build a more mobile, resilient military force. The People's Republic of China has yet to renounce the use of force against Taiwan and is increasingly uh, using its aggression and, and coercion in the, in the region. So I think this is a a real concern. During his confirmation hearing at the U.S. Senate, Ratner said that the possibility of a PLA invasion of Taiwan was a real concern. Senator Jake Sullivan, who recently visited Taiwan, asked him to comment on whether an invasion was possible in the next six years, a timeline suggested by top U.S. Admiral Philip Davidson. I agree with that timeline. Senator, it's a very important question. I agree with uh, Admiral Davidson's sense of urgency. Um, I don't think it's particularly useful to put a pin on a, on a timeline and in the absence of the United States to impose sufficient costs and denial capability, uh, I think there is a potential that they would use aggression against Taiwan to achieve their political aims. Ratner said the U.S. needed to put more funding toward deterring China from invading Taiwan. He also expressed support for the Tsai administration's national defense strategy. President Tsai is committed to taking Taiwan's uh, military in the right direction, and I'm encouraged by the steps she's been taking to try to develop a more mobile and, and resilient military, uh, and that's an incredibly important part of the deterrent in the region, and if confirmed, I would look forward to advancing that agenda. Also on Wednesday, several U.S. congressmen reintroduced the Taiwan Defense Act. The legislation aims to ensure that the U.S. maintains the ability to counter Chinese attempts to invade Taiwan and execute a fait accompli. The term fait accompli refers to a Chinese strategy to seize control of Taiwan before the U.S. military can respond, while attempting to convince the U.S. that responding to the invasion would be prohibitively difficult or costly. And according to Reuters, bipartisan U.S. representatives plan to introduce another bill later this week, the Taiwan Peace and Stability Act. The bill is designed to promote Taiwan's diplomatic, economic and physical space. Democrat Ami Barra says he expects much of the act to be eventually included into the Ensuring American Global Leadership and Engagement Act, which aims to counter policy challenges posed by China. Once again, Congress is making moves to strengthen Washington's support for Taiwan.